Speaker of the House of Representatives Femi Bajabiamila, who was a guest speaker of the event, said it is very disturbing that there are indeed a lot of misconceptions about the role of the legislature in Nigeria's democracy, and it is more disturbing that even those are educated have the same feeling. One of the peculiarities of our democracy in Nigeria is that much of our population does not understand the legislature's role in our democratic arrangement. At best, there is a recognition that Parliament has a responsibility to make laws for the good governance of the nation. However, the realities of resource availability and the imperatives of policy and politics, culture and tradition that impose limitations on Parliament are not recognized and understood by most. The Distinguished Parliamentarians Lecture Series is a worthy innovation. It is an opportunity to provide information and context to help our fellow Nigerians better understand the democracy we practice. The Senate President Amelon said that the Parliament will remain the most misunderstood the world over for a very long time especially on the issue of collecting jumbo pays. But in the actual sense, the National Assembly is on the funded chairman of the occasion, the governor of Kaduna State, Nasur Erufai, though commended the Ninth Assembly for passing into law notions and bills that have impacted on the lives of, of Nigerians. But he said there are other critical areas the lawmakers must look at in the few months they have got to go. We believe that Nigeria first. We believe that the national interest must always take precedence on what we do in this ninth National Assembly. No matter what, at the end of the day, we want to write our names. We will not wait for anybody to write for us in gold or platinum. Reforming the local government system uh, to make the local governments more autonomous of the state, but yet make each local government flexible to meet the needs of the state because in a diverse country like Nigeria one local government system does not fit all we have our histories we have our traditions what can work in Kaduna where the native authority system used to work very well in northern Nigeria cannot work in Anambra state the Director General of the National Institute of Legislative and Democratic Studies, Professor Abubakar Suleiman, said the lecture which gives lawmakers the opportunity to share their stories with the public will also strengthen the robust relationship between the executive and the legislative arm of government. It's an avenue of legislative narration and a veritable platform connecting both the elected representative and the people beyond the confines of the two allo chambers. But Jabir Amila also suggested that future legislative agendas need to be more collaborative to aid implementation. Abdul Yusuf, National Assembly, Liberty News.